Guess who woke up to absolutely no water? No water this morning at all. Um, so this is why I look like, <laughs> I just, I've tried to put a bit of makeup on. I've not filled in my eyebrows, but um, I've got to take Ben to summer camp this morning. It's Wednesday, it's hallway day, slap bang in the middle of the summer holidays. We are just coming out of a heat wave. No water, burst pipe up the road. I'm hoping I'm gonna do the summer camp drop and I'm hoping that when I get back, I can have a shower and I can put a load of washing on. I'm not, it's actually caused me, like I'm quite an anxious person anyway, but Mike came upstairs and said, there's no water. And I said to him a few days ago, we were hearing about like water rationing and that sort of thing. And I couldn't work out whether it was like the, like the newspapers and stuff trying to like scare them on going I was like I, I actually think if I turned on a tap and there was no water I'd, I'd be slightly panicked and I did I felt I felt ever so slightly panicked luckily we had um I'd filled up like my water bottles and our water bottles last night before we went to bed I always do that anyway so we have had a drink um but yeah not ideal really alright babe have you had anything to eat? Have you had anything to eat? I'll come down and get you some breakfast. What's that look for you? Look, the lawn. not hanging the washing on the line because I've got quite a lot of work to do today and once I've done my um, Tom and my housework and all the mum stuff that I have to do I know that once I get into like deep focus that'll be it and I just get really annoyed if I have to go outside and start bringing in the washing um, and the rain that came down yesterday it's the cat was crazy it's, it's just the amount there's like a deluge of water but yet but we're we're still in a drought i've been i shared this on my um instagram the other day a picture of it because i'm trying to use less of the tumble dryer aren't we all um it's kinder on the bucket it's kinder on the planet um i actually got this a couple of years ago from no last year from wayfair and um, it's actually still on sale so if you put in wayfair um Lath, I don't know how I don't know how you say it. Lath, L A T H, Lath Air. It's a six. I've got the six Lath one. It's about hundred quid. Um, I love it. I, I I use it all the time, and I hang when I, when I hang stuff on it, I hang it in obviously on hangers, and you all know how much I hate ironing, and it means that it really, it really cuts the ironing time down, and it also make sure that the stuff can dry um, without too many creases and without having to use the top dryer. It's back on. I have washed my hair. The kettle is on. I'm about to make myself a cup of tea. Ben's at summer camp. I've done my level ones, apart from the bathrooms. I've not done them yet. Um, I'm just going to do my 30 minutes in the hallway whilst my hair is air drying and then probably get a little bit of admin done as well then i'm going to dry my hair and then i'm going to film another youtube video so there's some stuff going on that i just want to talk to you about whilst i'm having my coffee or whilst i'm waiting for a coffee to make so obviously you have to be living under a rock to not to have not noticed that the cost of living crisis like, oh, everything is like going up isn't it now one of the things that i always was very important to me with the organizer method was that it was free to access you can follow it along for free you can download the free principles from the website you do not have to spend a penny you do not even have to give me your email because the reason why that's important to me is because when i was in a tight spot like i just had tom postnatal anxiety etc even though I created it, you know, it helped me and I found a solution for free. So I, I want to make that accessible for people that you don't have to pay, right? Now, the organized time technique, up to now, there haven't been any free resources. So we had the app. Now, 
I've, I've, I've just pulled the app from sale because there's a few things that we need to do. Um, the If you're a current user, don't worry about it. Your app will work, but we're just no, we're not taking on any new users. So I have created some free resources for TOT so that if you are in a spot, if you maybe have to get a second job, maybe you're struggling to set up a routine, maybe um, you have had to um, get rid of your cleaner because you can't afford it anymore because you're tightening your belt, you're cutting back, that sort of thing. Um, and you're having to sort of re do your routine for whatever reason you feel like you need to be more efficient they are now going to be free for you to download in the same way that the Tom principles are free to download if you want to take a deep dive into it and obviously you can buy it the book or you can go and get it from the library Hold on. let's turn off the kettle um, yeah so they're gonna be coming coming out and there is a couple of videos as well one of the final one which I've got to film today um, about how to use those principles, how to create a routine for you if you just want to do it like the, the bare bones. about to film a YouTube video all about the organised time technique. I have done Tom, I've had my lunch, I've dried my hair, it's 12.30, one of my, is my, I don't know what's going on with my clothes today, they're like a, a dust m magnet, <laughs> I don't know what it is. Um, Wednesdays is one of my favourite days because that is the day when um, the Rock the Housework episodes drop. So I always kind of breathe a little bit of a sigh of relief on a Wednesday because I fulfilled my duties in terms of Rock the Housework and the subscribers on there. Um, I take it very seriously. People pay their £3.60 a month. And, you know, especially now, I'm really, really grateful that people are a member of the vault. Um, so I take it really seriously. It's my, one of my priority jobs of the week. So on Wednesday, they've gone live. I know that box is ticked. So I'm like, okay, I can think about other stuff. Looking out the window because I think the thunder is coming. Um, it's three o'clock. I'm still trying to get my head around TikTok. If you don't follow me on TikTok, please do. <laughs> I feel so old. I feel so old on TikTok. Um, Thomas is helping me. He um, He's 16, obviously, as you know, so um, he knows a lot more about TikTok than I do. Um, I'm going to go to the gym now. I still haven't done the bathrooms, and the kids are going to go to my mum and dad's for dinner tonight. Mike works late today so he's working late today so I'm going to come back and do some more work after the gym. I don't know what I'm going to cook for tea yet um, but my cooking videos, um, I'm doing more cooking videos on YouTube, not on YouTube, this is YouTube, on Instagram, there's so many channels. I'm doing more cooking videos on Instagram and um, a lot of people are loving it so I don't know what I'm going to cook yet, but now I've got that thing where like, I feel like I can never cook my something itself something really simple because I'm wasting an opportunity to like develop a recipe. I don't know. So I'm going to go to the gym. Um, I've done a spin. It's Wednesday, so I did spin on Monday and Tuesday. So Wednesday is a strength day. Which I find it so boring, strength. Just don't get the same buzz as you do with spin. Going back to spin tomorrow though. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to go and pick Ben up from camp. Hope I don't get rained on. Hope I don't get funded on. Um, drop the kids off at mum and dad's and come back, do a bit more work, cook dinner, wait for Mike to get home and clean the bathrooms because I still haven't done them. I can't actually see any clouds on the horizon but you know do you ever get those headaches like when you know a storm's coming it's something to do with like the, the air pressure isn't it? I've definitely got one of those. I feel like that. Um, <laughs> what is that? Um, what is that woman on um, Mean Girls where she's like, like she can tell the weather with her boobs or something? Have I completely, have I completely made that up in my head? I don't know. Anyway, that's not. It's there. 
Do you think I get it's, it's, it's here? Anyway, I'm gonna get changed to the gym. It's ten past seven. I've obviously been to the gym. I've obviously not showered after the gym. Um, I've just put a YouTube series live three videos about the organised time technique. Um, so I filmed all them, got all them out. I also just um, realised my phone was going ping, 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 ping. Um, that a bit of press coverage came out today. I wasn't expecting it to come out today. I was kind of expecting it to come out next week. So I just had to sort of like deal with phone calls from like my mum and my sister. I'm like, Gemma, I've just seen you in the paper. Like, yeah, hate, I never read it, I hate it. I actually, I just, just, blah, blah. Anyway, I'm, I'm um, worried now that I'm gonna go into spin tomorrow and I'm like, are you, were you? No, no, it wasn't me. Must be my evil twin. Um, so, I'm going to just wait for this final video to upload, review it, watch it, and then I'm going to go and get the kids and I'm going to go and cook tea. I've still not done the bathrooms. Um, <laughs> anyway, so that's whereabouts I am at the moment. Okay, it's late. The dinner conversation. It's a ready meal from Marks and Spencers. However, I have I have done the bathroom. I've thundered, but. We have got some big clouds rolling in. 